When this was device was first put on your ankle, were you able to watch him do it? Yes. Was it the 15th that you had the accident with the bracelet? I believe so. I believe you testified that you went down to the Federal Probation Department as a result of this incident? Correct. The next morning I called the Probation Department, spoke with Mr. Aquilano, told him the events, who told me to come into the office to get it um, basically repaired, um, and, which I did. What was said in the conversation with Mr. Aquilano on that date? Basically words to the effect of, um, I stepped in a narrow place and um, got it caught. Did Mr. Aquilano make a repair? Uh, yes. Did you watch him do it? Yes. How many times in total would you say that you took the bracelet off? I can only get an estimate, um, but I figured probably 10 to a dozen. At any point in time when you had the bracelet off, uh, did you leave your home? Yes. Can you tell me at any point in time when you had the bracelet off, did you ever receive a call from the federal government, the U.S. Probation Department? No. If federal probation had a check on you uh, and based on one of these tampers, and would have you stopped? Yes. If they had checked on you, would have you stopped taking the device off? Yes. Let me ask you this. Had Mr. Aquilano checked on you, would have you done the things that you did that are the basis of this lawsuit, i.e. the events of the night of March 14th, 2013? Most likely not. Did you feel that you could take the bracelet off whenever you wanted to and not risk having probation call you? Yes. You knew that if you took it off and left it off for a certain period of time, you'd be okay? Yeah, less than a certain amount of time, yes. And what was a certain amount of time? Um, I don't know. Since I didn't know the upper limit, I kept it to as short a time as possible. Was there any role that probation played by the fact that they were not contacting you when the tampers would happen or anything like that, uh, that, uh, that uh, embolden you to go forward with what eventually happened on March 14th? I would say yes, um, because um, of the lack of um, response to certain actions. Uh, that I knew that, uh, or assumed, anyways, that uh, there was, um, I had greater freedom.